Hey guys, my name's Tori and um, I've been asked to make a YouTube channel for so long by so many different people um, and yeah, so I thought why not a better time to do it in lockdown because um, they asked me to do it through like the whole of school, some people in college asked me to do it so I just thought why not um, so I'm just today I'm just going to be answering questions um and yeah hope you enjoy if you could be one celebrity who would it be um Gemma Collins all the way she is me I am her love her to bits like she's just got that vibe about her I just love her um where do you shop for your clothes um I shop Pretty Little Thing, Misguided, Boohoo. I don't rely on Boohoo too much because it can be really see-through and the quality I don't find is very good. Um, I also love Primark. Love a bit of Primark. Topshop, H&M, River Island. Love it. Um, if you could go on holiday, where would it be? Grand Canaria. Definitely Gran Canaria, all the way. But I just, I think it's so nice. It just looks, I don't know, I just want to go there. I've always wanted to. Um, so, yeah. Um, what are your thoughts on tattoos and piercings? Um, love it. I mean, I really want a tattoo. And I'm going to when lockdown is over. <clears throat> um, so I have nothing bad to say about tattoos. And I love piercings. I've got my tongue, my belly, my ears. Had my nose, but it fell out. But I'm going to get it redone when this is over because I really liked it. Um, and yeah. What are your thoughts on people that still go out during lockdown? Um... I think they're very selfish um, if you're still going to meet your mates or your boyfriend or your girlfriend because it's just never going to get solved if you still go out, do you know what I mean? Um, Yeah, it's just never going to get solved, is it? What are your thoughts on plastic surgery? Um, I have no problem with it like I really want my lips done um I'm going to get them done as soon as I found some fucking money because you know skin <laughs> um but yeah no I have no problem with them whatsoever I think if people want to get them done they want to get them done like I want my lips done because that's something I'm really insecure about and like in this world it's hard to really like yourself like because there's so many bitter nasty people about so people get it to make themselves feel better and I want my lips done so I have no problem with plastic surgery what school did you go to and do you miss it um I went to Homewood and no it was the worst experience of my life it is the reason why I have such bad mental health and no I don't miss it at all I'm glad I'm out do you miss anyone I miss about four people apart from that the rest of the school fucking bullied me so no literally miss about four people because <laughs> everyone else is just nasty but yeah there are some people that kept me going so I'm always thankful for them people um, where are you from? I'm from Kent, um, and I live in some place called Tenton. It's just full of old bud- biddies, really. Not, not many people live here. Uh, how old are you? I'm 17, 18 in November, and yeah. Uh, what tattoo do you want? Um, I want to get a tattoo on my ankle. Um, 
that says sometimes you've got to fall before you fly because it has a lot of meaning to me um, because obviously I got really badly bullied at school and I feel like and I just felt like I can't do this anymore like I just wanted to kill myself every day and stuff like, it's a really personal subject but um, yeah and that's um, <clears throat> that's why I want to get that tattoo because I believe that you know you fall and you get back up and you fly so yeah it has a lot of meaning to me I've always wanted it done and um, how did you get through your bullying um, <laughs> barely got for it like I'm still here so that's something, but it takes a lot, it takes a lot to get through, um, it really does ruin who you are as a person, um, it changes your whole view and your state of mind, um, it just really damages you, yeah, being bullied does damage you a lot, um, so, all I can say is, is to just keep being strong, um, all them thoughts in your head will eventually go away, like, mine haven't, but I'm sure in later years they will eventually go away, and I can't sit there and say, like, ignore them, because it doesn't work, you've just got to have willpower and strength and just tell yourself to keep going every day, and find things that you want to get up for, so even though I was getting bullied at school, I loved doing makeup, even though I wasn't that good at it, so I'd get up, brush my teeth, and do my makeup to sort of give me the motivation to go, and I'd like give myself something for after school so I'd say go to school come home and I don't know like um it's so it's quite hard to explain but I'd give myself something to do after school so I'd look forward to it throughout the whole day so when people said stuff I'd just be like you've got that to look forward to after school just take no notice and it is really hard really hard um but as I've said a million times they won't get far they may think that they will but people like that never get far in life at all they just won't how did you lose all your weight um so I used to be 15 stone I'm now 10 um I went to the gym five times a week I cut out unhealthy food and um, I went to Weight Watchers so um, so it's like you get a certain amount of points every day so I think I had like 28 points um, a day and I'd only have like 12 points um, <clears throat> so I wouldn't eat that much um did you ever self harm yeah i did um quite a bit actually but yeah it's another quite a personal subject um so yeah <laughs> um next question um who do you fancy that is <laughs> i mean <clears throat> i'm not just gonna say his name on a youtube channel um but yeah i do fancy someone um but yeah so <laughs> that's all the questions um i hope you've enjoyed my q a and have fun in quarantine and yeah
don't forget to subscribe.